are here with Karen Eland, the world's probably only espresso artist. This is totally different from latte art because she's actually painting on, when you have watercolor paper with um, espresso. So tell us a little bit about how did you come to use espresso and um, what is your technique? Well, I first thought of it in a coffee shop in Tulsa, Oklahoma, and about 10 or 11 years ago, I had my watercolor stuff, and I was just bored with that, and looking at the espresso coming out of the machine, and I just loved the color, and I tried it, it worked, so I just started doing, like, picture after picture, and people liked it, just kept going. Excellent. So, do you make... The espresso, where do you get the espresso? Do you have your own machine at home? I wish. <laughs> I have. I get it from a local coffee shop that I used to work at as well, so they let me behind the bar and I just make some shots of espresso right there in the um, lovely lawnmowers I'll go and um, just start painting with it. This is actually some old stuff that it actually still works to paint with, and so just use it up. Do you want to? Continue. Where were you? We I don't even you. know. I just kind okay. of jump around in the picture. But okay. This is a shop in Venice that I went to a couple years ago, and I thought I would work on that. So. This is incredible. This is lovely. Do you do a lot of that, taking masterpieces and recreating yeah, them? Yeah. I mainly I started out doing that just to kind of see if the coffee could do a real painting. I was like, well, Mona Lisa's. If I can make it look like that, then maybe it can hold up to the more pictures. kind of amusing for people to, you know, oh, you should do this one, you should do that one. And now I'm just recently, I'm starting my own pictures that I've taken myself. <laughs> yeah. Do you know of any other painters that are doing this? I didn't at first, but then the more I saw how it worked, the more I was like, just someone else must have thought of this. So I looked online, found a few more people all around the world. Actually, there was someone from Arabia and India and South America. It's just like I guess everyone thought of it, you know, all at once or something. But kind of the collective consciousness. Yeah, came yeah and together. It's everyone's style is totally different. They mix charcoal or they just do wax. One guy puts wax with it. Well, thank you so very much, Karen. It's so nice to meet you. We're going to take a little. Yeah, take a tour. Of www.coffee-art.com